everybody to our webinar tonight. So while we get uh, things situated here, we would love to hear from all of you. Who is joining us tonight and where are you joining us from? I am super excited to be here tonight um, with one of my good friends and fellow custom blend mixologists, I guess we can call you. Um, so once you let us know where you are joining us from, we would also love to know if you have ever gotten a custom blend. Do you currently, you know, custom blend? Have you been to any classes? Just so we kind of know who our audience is tonight. But with no further ado, we will go ahead and get started. So I just wanted to introduce myself for those of you that don't know me. Um, my name is Lee Rader and I've been a licensed master co cosmetologist. This is my 29th year. I am also a retired salon owner. I owned a salon for about 13 years and started that from absolutely nothing and built it up to be a very successful business. Um, I did have employees. I also had people that rented their chair there. So I kind of have worked in all sorts of different facets of that. Um, and that's really how I came across the custom blend system. I actually was looking for new things to add into our salon, things that nobody else were, was doing. And I don't know about you guys, but one of the things that I found was a lot of people cannot find the right foundation for them. So it really did fit great into my salon. Um, we created a lot of buzz with it, and we'll talk about that a little bit tonight. It also was a huge income um, maker for our salon, which I was extremely grateful for as well. Um, and that kind of led me into becoming a global educator with the brand Modus Cosmetics that offers the custom blend system. I wanted to start to teach others on how they could start implementing custom blend and learning how to blend and, uh, you know, just really have a little bit more options to what they're currently doing. So I did become a global educator, and then I also became a Modus Field Consultant, which means I work directly with the company, just helping them with different education and marketing initiatives and work closely with those of you that actually are partnered with our brand and go back to the company and let them know what we need. So I'm very excited to be here tonight. I know a lot of you are excited as well. So thank you so much for joining us. And I would love Martha to introduce herself. Hi, everybody. I'm super excited to be here tonight talking about one of my favorite subjects, which is the custom blend and system. Um, but my name is Martha Tello Rosser. I'm from the Austin, Texas area. I always covers in my in my life and my and the things that I do, but all things beauty come next. Um, I have been custom blending now since 2014. Um, I incorporated it into the salon and spa that I owned in Albuquerque, New Mexico. Um, it's actually one of the very first uh, products that I did incorporate when I had finally made the decision to start putting products back into my business. Uh, there was a time where I didn't have a lot of products and I would send clients here, there and everywhere. Um, but as a business owner, I needed to make a big decision and choose a product to go uh, with what I was doing. And Custom Blend is where I started. And um, so I'm excited to be sharing that with you today. I have been in the beauty industry for over 20 years. Um, I am a makeup artist. Um, I am a licensed massage therapist. I've done that for over 10 years as well. And just like Lee, um, I am a retired salon owner. Mine was more forceful. Um, my husband inadvertently fired me from being the boss of my uh, salon and moved me from Albuquerque, New Mexico back to Texas. Uh, but this system right here did a lot for me to help me um, be able to run my salon remotely for 18 months. And it gave me a lot of flexibility to reestablish myself in the Austin, Texas area. So um, there's a lot of things that I've done in my past to help me help you now figure out what you want to do to move your businesses forward. And Custom Blend is definitely one of them. So I'm super excited um, to be sharing with y'all tonight. 
and especially with Lee, uh, she is one of my besties from the resties. And uh, uh, we have a lot of uh, things that line up. We have a lot of similarities. And of course, everybody has their differences, but we um, get along extremely great. So let's just start with the demand for customization. I don't know how many of you have ever gone to the store and looked at all the shelves of all the different foundation formulas and colors. And I mean, it's very confusing. And that's exactly what a lot of my clients tell me. You know, they're like, I'm trying to find the right thing and I'm not always able to try them. Sometimes they're trying to, you know, find the best match, but it's just not really that close. And I end up settling for something that isn't really for me. And I love this because this is from an article and it just, it was saying that another way is customized products where consumers really get to dictate what they want and the brand creates products to meet those needs. Now, in a sense, customization isn't new because people have always mixed and matched the brands they use, but what is new are the technology platforms to really help people literally build their own products. Now, who doesn't love that, right? The sound of, I get to decide not only what's in my products, but what it's going to look like on my skin, how it's going to feel, what ingredients are in there, and it's going to match, right? So that is really what people want. And I love this right here. This speaks volume. It says, according to Brazilian artist Angelica Das, who has been photographing people of every color ma and matching every subject skin tone to hues from the Panatone printing color chart to codify a unique chromatic inventory, there are at least 4,000 skin colors in the human rainbow. I love how she photographed them and matched them up to already existing colors in that Panatone um, color system, right? Um, because when we go to different places to find a foundation where you really only have maybe 20 to about 30 colors to choose from. And 20 to 30 colors is not going to meet the needs of over 4,000 skin tones. And this is what she's found to date. I'm sure it's way more. Um, so I think it's beautiful to be able to see all the hues that we see to the left Inside. You see a lot of pink skin, you see a lot of orangey skin, you see yellow skin, you see very fair skin, very dark skin, and I just think they're all beautiful. It's so true. So we really do have the solution, and that's with our Motives Custom Blend line. So we're going to get into a little bit more about what the line has to offer. But if you think about a customizing product that accommodates everyone's unique sets of traits, personal coloring, skin type, age, lifestyle, personality, and preferences, we can customize it all. It guarantees 100% customer satisfaction. Our customers are not just stuck with that formula. Like where I live, we're going into like spring and hopefully summer soon as well. And I usually have a totally different skin tone in the summer versus winter, right? So we're able to really uh, be able to adjust the formula for them. And so they don't have to just throw it away or throw it under their sink and forget about it. It also builds unwavering loyalty and makes you the makeup artist indispensable because you have the formula. You're the only one that can mix it up for them. So they have to continue to come back to you to get that product made. You guys are going to see later on the profitability of the product and it's a very easy inventory control. In fact, I have it right behind me right here and it doesn't take up much room on my makeup station at all. It gives your business prestige and exclusivity. It's easy promotion and marketing. It creates excitement and fun. I actually call it my therapy when I get to mix because it's so relaxing and so much fun to just go in my studio and mix up my formulas. Uh, I love that you said unwavering loyalty. So um, I've been gone from Albuquerque since 2014, but we are now in 2023, right? Um, well, not since 2000, to, since 2016. Um, and we're almost 2024, right? You know, we're halfway there. Um, and I have retained about 70% of my clients who have purchased custom blend still purchase custom blend for me till this day. And like you said, you do change um, from summer to winter. And sometimes you want um, minimal coverage. Sometimes you want full coverage and you can 
address that. So I think that that speaks volumes as well. Um, so we do, you know, the foundation and the powder creates the canvas to which all the other products are applied. So it is essential that this step is done right. When you have a foundation and the foundation doesn't look that great, when you apply everything else, it kind of throws everything else off too, whether the under is wrong or the coverage is wrong or the, the formula itself is wrong. So foundation and powder are the hardest products uh, for women to find. But I can tell you this, when a woman finds that foundation, they will stick to that foundation forever and ever. Amen. You may even be one of those people who still uses that very first foundation that you were introduced to, or you may have a client that you have come across and they're like, yeah, I've been using this foundation since I was like a sophomore in high school. And they tend to buy the same color, um, even though they are no longer that color. We are very loyal to the formula that we are happy with. Um, so it does build that, again, unwavering loyalty whenever you are being able to fulfill the needs that the client needs. So when pro properly matched, foundation and powder should be invisible. It should make your client's skin look flawless, smooth, yet not feel heavy. Um, and that's a big thing, especially this day and age when people want that um, full glam look without the heaviness. That's really important. Um, a high quality product will help to protect your skin by creating a physical barrier that will prevent toxins and free radicals from penetrating into your skin. Um, and that's what I love about our custom blend too, that it really does help heal and take care of the skin when we are wearing it because of the properties that are in it. Now we can actually perfect color by both adjusting the base shades and matching natural undertones. We also have modifiers and additives which allow you to adjust the texture, coverage, and finish of the foundation. We also offer advanced skincare serums that can be added into the foundation. You guys, that is huge because a lot of people are looking for those beauty with benefits, you know, products that can actually do a lot for their skin. In fact, I know you've had this too, but you've had people say, is it possible my skin is actually getting better from switching over to this custom blend foundation? And absolutely. We also have modifiers and additives, which allow you to create just the right foundation combination for any skin tone and skin type. Doesn't matter if it's liquid, cream, powder, uh, we can do it all. And so, like I said, we have very different properties that maybe that some people are not used to seeing in a foundation. We have a mineral-based formula that's infused with botanicals that provide long-lasting coverage with a lightweight feel. Um, I have an actual very full, full coverage foundation, but if you saw me in person, you wouldn't believe it. Um, it's ideal for all skin types. It includes modifiers and enhancers to further customize your foundation and target specific concerns. So we're going to actually customize it to your likes and wants and needs, not just something that is bottled that matches, you know, okay. Um, it is oil-free, it is talc-free, it is fragrance-free, and it's non-comedogenic. This is very important to a lot of people because we don't want um, some of those properties that are not very um, helpful for the skin in our foundations, and it helps maintain its natural color and tone. So there's a lot of different ways that we can actually offer custom blend. And one of the ways that I love doing it is in-person consultations. Now, I think we can all agree that today when the market is so competitive and so similar, what is your edge? Well, our edge really does rely on our customer service and your communication skills. People really want someone there to help guide them and help create this for them. I don't care. I don't think it can ever be recreated by a computer or some kind of a tool or, you know, I know there's a lot of different things out there that try to match your skin tone. Like nothing can replace that one-to-one -one interaction that we have with our clients. Now, I don't know, maybe you're a makeup artist, maybe you're a hairstylist, maybe, you know, you're just a makeup connoisseur, you know, I don't know where you are at, but if you've ever had the privilege of working one-on-one -on -one services with a client, you kind of get that where, you know, people want that person there to help them with their needs. The other edge is making sure that you have a unique product that customers cannot buy anywhere else. I think we can also all agree that products are readily available at this point everywhere on the internet, right? So you can just Google something and try to find it. And so unfortunately, a lot of our beauty um, brands have 
become readily available for our clients. I actually like that my clients have to come back and get this from me because it keeps not only the profit in my pocket, but it allows me to adjust things for the client to really be there for them and be really that one-stop full service um, business for them. Now, this is going to just go over. We also have virtual consultations that we can offer, which I know a lot of us have been doing for quite a few years. So this video is just going to kind of go over what that looks like. Motive's Custom Blend Foundation is the perfect solution to finding a foundation that matches your exact skin. What sets it apart is that it can be customized to the desired coverage, texture, and finish of your skin. We can even use skincare additives, so it truly is the perfect formula for you. This service is offered by Motive's Certified Custom Blend Consultants. Finding a consultant in your area isn't always an option. However, you can still experience the luxury of having personalized products formulated just for you through a virtual no-touch appointment. Here's how it works. First, we will determine your desired sun protection, coverage, texture, skin type, and finish. This can be done through a series of questions and our online custom blend survey. Then we determine your exact skin tone and undertone. This can be done during our live Zoom appointment, or you can send pictures of yourself in natural lighting. Throughout the appointment, you will see your custom blend consultant mixing up your perfect formula. Once your custom blend is formulated, a full size powder or liquid foundation will be shipped right to your doorstep. You will then be able to experience the amazing benefits that come with this mineral-based formula. Looking for a fun virtual event you can do with your friends while earning free makeup? Ask your custom blend consultant how you can plan a virtual get-together. Have fun, hang out, all while providing your friends with their own personalized custom blend formula. Motives can't wait to create the perfect foundation for you. I love that you can actually do it virtually. Um, and I've been doing virtually since um, I was I moved from Albuquerque to uh, Texas. It was one of the things that really helped um, me continue to move um, my business forward. But the ability to virtually customize somebody's foundation from scratch is really amazing. Again, these are things that you are custom creating for other people so you can have that perfect match. And you can do this one-on-one, -on -one, again, in person, or uh, virtually. Of course, in-person wins 10 times over. You know, you don't get that feeling virtually, but um, you can definitely create that perfect look for somebody. And now with technology, right, when we have Zoom and we have FaceTime and all these different tools, it really does allow us to, you know, reach a broader audience. I can also tell you that we have clients reaching out from all over the U.S. looking for consultants in their area. And so we would love to just expand our team all over, you know, the U.S. and Canada to help provide that service for customers in person. But if not, we can always offer them, you know, that virtual option. So we're going to kind of dig in a little bit to our liquid mineral uh, systems. We're going to kind of go through what the, the additives are and what's possible with the system. So we have SPF. So we do have the ability to actually incorporate additional SPF into the foundation. As the foundation is mineral and it does create a barrier already, you're going to have a natural SPF of six to eight in it, but we can increase that SPF till 10 to about 14, uh, just depending on how much SPF you add into it. And our SPF is a pomegranate not in greasy. Again, it's an additive that you can add to your custom foundation. That's what I really love about it because I do not like greasy products on my skin. So I love that this SPF option, you get that protection without the greasiness. This is one of my favorite additives. It's called Beauty Balm and it is a five in one cream that primes hydrates, lightens, firms, and visibly improves the look of the skin. Who doesn't want that? It does use ingredients like dimethicone and aloe vera, which condition the skin, it does have some licorice root extract, which brightens the skin. It also does have vitamin A or retinol, which helps reduce the appearance of fine lines and wrinkles for firmer looking skin. Um, so it also has other vitamins that really do help maintain the skin's healthier appearance. And it's inspired by cutting age Asian beauty rituals. 
This is a five in one secret for achieving that flawless skin. So I love using this pretty much in everyone's formula. I'll put a little bit in, but it's really great for those that want kind of more of a moisture plus tint, or they want more of that beauty balm, uh, sort of, uh, formula. So it has a lot of uses for it, but it is a wonderful ingredient. And so most people ask, you know, if you're adding SPF in there, if you're adding beauty balm, like, does it affect the coverage? Yes, it does affect the coverage, but we have additives that we can um, put back the coverage and the pigment into the skin. Or if you want it even further diluted, we have thinner where we can take a little bit more of the pigmentation away. So thinner is used to shear the coverage of the foundation to make it more like a tinted moisturizer or a tinted SPF. Um, but if we add all these things in it and we still want a full coverage, we have what we call coverage enhancer. This is used to increase the foundation coverage, which will help uh, hide any imperfections, dark circles, and it's gonna give you that maximum coverage. Um, like I said earlier, I have a full coverage foundation um, because I have a good amount of coverage enhancer in it. So this is 28% pigment straight out of the little jar. It's 28% 28 pigment. So this will definitely hide all the indiscretions of your whole entire life if you need it to, um, because we can bump up the pigment. One of the things people don't realize is Foundations that you get over the counter usually have only about six to seven percent pigment in it. So we can actually boost up that pigment so that you don't have to layer as much foundation on to get that full coverage look. Um, we can do it by adding more pigment into your foundation. So the best way I know how to explain this is if you put a pantyhose on, right, and you can see through that pantyhose, it just has less pigment than if you put a pantyhose on that is more opaque that you can't see through, that has more pigment into it. Um, so it's not necessarily heavier. It's not necessarily um, harder to wear. It just has more pigment in it. And so we can do that to your foundation. Hopefully that makes sense when it comes to pigment. Yeah. And I know a lot of my clients, they're like, you know, I really want the coverage, but I don't want it to feel heavy or cakey. And we can really get that coverage with this. And because it's so pigmented, it does not feel that way. Cause I'm like you, Martha, like I've got, I've got some things that I like to cover and you would never know that I have as many scoops coverage enhancer as I do in my formula because it still looks like my skin, but I get that really great coverage. Now we also have some modifiers and additives that affect the finish. So one of our additives is mattifier, and this really gives the foundation a powder finish. It's also great for those that have more of that combination to oily skin because it does have French clay in it, which is an absorbent with a mattifying effect. So it does help keep a shine-free finish. So I know my oily skin clients absolutely love it. But we also have pearl, which gives the foundation kind of that dewy, youthful glow to the skin. Great for dry skin, great for aging skin, because it just gives that nice, youthful look to the skin. Also looks great in some other formulas that we'll talk about later that you can do besides foundation. And so we do have base shades, right? So we do have a seven shades that we consider our base, like where we start from. Um, but we can create so many different uh, formulations of this to perfect it for your skin type. So this is just a starting point. And I always tell people, um, I know where we're starting and where we, end, where we end looks very different, but don't worry, we'll get there. So our bases, our very first one is ivory, and it has a yellow undertone to it. And then we have, and this one has, undertone to it and then we have beige which is the third one right here and it's more of a neutral color it doesn't have too much yellow and it doesn't have too much pink in it so it has a neutral tone to it um, then we have tan tan tends to be more of a golden brown color and then we have hazelnut hazelnut it's deep brown with a yellow undertone and then we have deep which is deep brown with a yellow red undertone and then we have espresso, which is a deep brown with a blue undertone. So again, these are only starting points. 
And like I mentioned earlier, um, when you buy foundation over the counter, you're only getting about 7%, 6 to 7% pigment straight out of the bottle. Well, our bases automatically come with 11% pigment. So that's almost double what you would get um, over the counter. And like I said, with our coverage enhancers that we just talked about, we can increase the pigment with every scoop that we add of that coverage enhancer. So this is a great um, place to start to really get that perfect color for you. Absolutely. And we can get it a lot lighter than ivory and a lot darker than espresso because we have pure pigment toners. Now these color toners are intensive concentrates that make it possible to color match any skin tone. And because they're not diluted with talc, it doesn't give the foundation that chalky look to it. Um, it's never dull and we are able to darken, lighten, add undertone, correct undertone using all of those pigment toners. And you know, I'm sure y'all are on Instagram and TikTok and all of these things. And you see people these days putting different colors of uh, pigments on their skin and mixing them up to find their perfect shade. Um, and they're using like these palettes and they're doing this every day. Well, we can do that and we could bottle all in a bottle for you so that you can take it home and you don't have to play with the color wheel um, the way that you see um, happening there. We can just put it all in one bottle, make it one easy step. Um, the other thing that I love about our custom blend is we do have botanicals in it and we do have different types of botanicals. This particular one is our ultra soothing. So this botanical is going to actually soothe the skin. So sometimes we have sensitive skin or we have a little bit of redness in the skin. So the centella extract is reported to have antioxidants and soothing properties protect and calm the skin, while calendula, um, which is a flower extract, will condition to the skin as well. So this is a great botanical to add um, in addition to your foundation to help customize it for you and your needs. Absolutely. We also have um, some additional skincare additives such as hydrator, which utilizes sodium PCA to help restore hydration and deliver water into the skin, it is recommended for all skin types and especially those with dry skin. We also have our oil control, which contains a combination of extracts that work to help control oil while providing purifying and calming qualities. And it's recommended for oily skin. You can even put both of these in your foundation if you have combination skin. And so that way we can put a little hydration into those dry skin areas and help a little bit with those uh, oily areas with our oil control. And a question that we usually get, if you put hydrator in and oil control, do they counter, uh, counteract each other? They do not. They're more time release. So if your skin needs a drink of water, the hydrator is going to kick in. Or if you're producing too much oil, control is going to uh, kick in, but they are not going to contradict each other in any way. But like I said, we do get that question. So I do want to address that here tonight. Um, I love that we can add all these skincare things to it. We can soothe the skin. We can calm the skin. We can give the skin a drink of water. We can control the oil. Um, but what other thing that is super important to us, right? Anti-aging. So we have our ultra firming. This botanical actually is going to give you the appearance of tighter looking skin, tighter and smooth looking skin. It has a soy protein that will soften the skin, give you that smooth look, give you that radiant appearance. When you put this on and when you have it in your foundation, you will feel like a tightening effect, which is pretty cool. Um, and you will see some of the areas that you may have fine lines or wrinkles or um, lack a little bit of luster, you will see it look more supple, more hydrated, more smooth, and you will feel that tightening effect. The next one we have is the copper peptide. So this is a mineral that's going to help support normal collagen and elastin, and it's going to diminish the, the appearance of fine lines and wrinkles. It's going to improve the appearance of the skin and promote hydration. So I actually have both of these in my foundation. I need all the skincare and anti-aging things. Again, this is something that you can get addict each other in any way. They're just actually going to give you all the anti-aging skincare that you need. So I love these. Yeah, we're reverse aging. That's why. <laughs> yeah, I'm like, I'm like, ooh, my skin looks real good. Yeah. 
We also have some primer that we can add into the foundation. Our first additive is Fringe Benefit. This locks in moisture, smooths and supports the appearance of the skin. It uses glycerin and dimethicone, which work in harmony to smooth skin, reduce the appearance of fine lines, and restore radiance for healthier looking skin. It helps the foundation glide over any imperfections, and you can actually also use it under the foundation as a primer, or you can add a little bit to the foundation. We also have our Sheer Perfection Age Defying Matte Primer. It's a lightweight matte finish, pore perfecting primer that smooths skin and minimizes the appearance of pores for effortless application of foundation and concealer. It uses poppy extract, which firms the appearance of the skin while glycerin maintains moisture in the skin. It also has antioxidants and vitamins that protect the skin, leaving it smooth, flawless, and natural and fresh. So it just really gives the foundation a whole new look, looks great on the skin. And we have this one I tend to use more for normal to dry skin. And this one is great for kind of more combination to oily skin as well. Right. And I don't think what we're talking about tonight, I don't think people realize um, the the depths that we go to really customize your foundation. Right. Most people think custom uh, cosmetics were just messing with color, but no, we're actually messing with the entire formula. It's really what you want. In it. We even mess with the texture of it. So um, this brings us to the whipping cream. So there are people who like a foundation that is more like a mousse texture, right? It's going to be a little bit more stiff and we have to put it in a jar um, so we can put whipping cream in it to give it that texture. Some people like it to be very liquidy. Like if you were to lift it up, it's going to look like a liquid. And then there's people who like it where somewhere in between. I'm one of those in between people. Like if I squirt it on my hand, it's going to stay there, but at, over time it is going to start running down, but I like it to be thicker in texture, not in, in coverage, not in um, feeling, but just that it's going to hold a little bit. So that whipping cream allows that to do it. So again, we can really customize it to your wants and needs. And what I love about our system is you can take it home after we custom create it for you. You can try it out for a few days. And if there's anything that we need to alter it, we can alter. Um, most of the time you take a foundation home, you're not happy with it and you throw it in the drawer and then you're irritated because you spent money and you don't really like the dang thing. Well, with us, don't do that. Don't throw it in the drawer. Call us and let us really alter it for you so we can perfect it um, because this is customizable. So we want to be able to customize it to your liking, to your perfection, right? Absolutely. So that was the liquid mineral system. Now we're going to give you a brief overview of our mineral powder system. The thing about mineral, uh, the custom blend mineral powders is they are made exclusively from micronized minerals. So they have a very exceptionally silky texture. So it gives that long lasting coverage with a lightweight natural feel. They are micro pulverized, which means they're cut in one millionth and then pulverized. So they float across the skin. They are very velvety smooth and they don't settle into the fine lines and wrinkles. So again, a lot of my clients are like, well, I was told I shouldn't use powder because it'll accentuate my wrinkles. It'll make me look older. It'll make me look drier. And then once they try the custom blend, I'll even just put a little bit on their hand and they're like, oh my gosh, it doesn't feel like powder. It's like silky smooth. And it just kind of like, melts into the skin it almost feels wet it's kind of like a cold like wet feeling almost um so if you take any day from tonight write this down you should always finish your foundation with some type of powder okay um it is a cream so if you are someone who's like my foundation doesn't last all day or i feel like my skin ate my foundation you absolutely have to set that liquid, even if you have dry skin, you still have to set that liquid with a powder. And the best one is a loose mineral powder that's been micro pulverized that has that velvety feeling that doesn't. Um, 
does um, contain micronized minerals that protect the skin with less irritation. This is also oil-free, fragrance-free, dye-free. So if you looked at any of the pictures of the powders, you see a hot pink color that comes straight from the earth. We do not add any dyes to it. It is free of bismuth oxychloride, which is known to be an of um, mineral products and things that have luster in it. So we do not have bismuth oxychloride in our um, mineral foundations because it's known to be a skin allergen. Um, so it makes our foundation um, non-comedogenic, leaving all of these things out of it. So when you look at those different colors, you do question like, is there any dyes in there? And there isn't, it comes from the, the earth that way. And they're also talc free and a lot of mineral uh, makeups actually have talc in them because talc is technically a mineral. So, but we choose to leave that out of our custom blend um, because it can cause that powdery look that I, a lot of people are afraid of, right? Or even an ashy look and it settles into those lines, making the skin look older and dry. Mineral powders actually form a breathable barrier that protect and promote healthy looking skin. So even those clients that are like, I don't really wear foundation, like I don't really want to wear too much, just actually having them put on just a light layer of these custom blend mineral powders are actually going to protect the skin from whatever they're exposed to in the elements. Um, the minerals are all natural earth minerals. The color is natural and it does promote that healthy looking skin. And people who are very into um, natural products, things that are very clean, things like that, you know, keep in mind, we are a mineral brand. We have products that, yes, they come from the earth and minerals are healing. So sometimes it's not necessarily giving a client a product for the coverage of it, but because of what the properties can do for their skin. So I think really opening the mind past just coverage and foundation, but more of what it can do for the skin can help you figure out who's going to be the ideal client for our custom foundations, or it could be yourself. You know, we could have clients on today who are like, Hey, I just want to know what custom blend is because I want some for me. So, um, real it's education is really important. You do not know until you know. Um, and just like our liquid system, we can put SPF in our powder system. Um, so this SPF is going to help protect and increase the SPF level of your powder as well. So um, unless the person's allergic to SPF, I put S SPF in everybody's, right? Um, so everybody needs SPF. We need protection from the sun. Absolutely. And sun is the number one ager. So definitely want to protect your skin. We can also adjust the coverage of the powder. So we do have a translucent modifier, which is used to decrease and create more sheer formulas. It works great in blush formulas. It also works great if somebody just wants a setting powder and they don't really want much more coverage. But then we also have coverage intensifier that we can use to increase the coverage. So if they feel like they still want a little bit more than what their liquid's getting, or I use this a lot in my clients who just wear a powder. They just want something to put on quick that's going to really even out their skin tone and give them nice coverage without, again, looking too heavy on the skin. And then, oh, this one right here, this one's my favorite. I'm just going to tell y'all a little tidbit, a secret. You know, I put this both in my liquid and my powder. Like I need this. This is our high definition powder. This is going to create that soft focus effect. It's going to give you like that in-person, um, Photoshop look, it's going to diffuse. It uses a lot of light to bounce uh, the light to give you that really flawless finish. So this goes great in your powder, goes great in your liquid. Um, it's colorless. So it's going to give you that flawless finish. It's going to adapt to every skin tone and type. It's talc free, not drying, but it's going to give you that real smoothed out look. I love this one. You could put this in pretty much anything. Yeah, and Martha kind of touched on it, but we can actually mix any of these powders in with our liquid formulas because they just dissolve and you get all the benefits. So this is what I call like the instant Instagram filter and like the way cameras are, everybody, like we need all the help we can get when it comes to kind of blurring out some of those like pores and wrinkles and fine lines and all those things that we see creeping up on us, right? Right. <laughs> 
And, you know, you, you just said something that, you know, whenever gives you that, like that photo finish, I will tell you, I work with a lot of photographers and I've worked with a lot of people in film and anytime I create a foundation, um, with our custom system, they don't have a lot of flashback, um, that they do not have to alter the skin um, as much as they would with most foundations. So I do get a lot of comments when it comes to the foundation. Photographers will, after the fact, message me and say, what did you use? Because I noticed X, Y, Z. So um, again, it's really good for in-person, you know, just the one-to-one, -one, but also on photo film and all of that fun stuff. So even though it's powder, we still have skincare for our powder formula. So we have our moisturizing complex, which increases hydration and delivers moisture for smoother looking skin. It uses uh, senaseed polysaccharide is a botanical polysaccharide that forms a protective film on the skin that binds water and fills up fine lines. So it actually attracts water from the air and puts it into your skin. So great, great for dry skin. It helps to moisturize the skin and improve the complexion for a more vibrant and youthful appearance. Then we have balancing complex, which helps promote natural oil to maintain a flawless matte finish throughout the day. It uses niacinamide, which helps maintain normal oil production and helps the skin maintain a brighter, more even complexion. And then we have, just like our liquid system, we have um, something that's going to help with hyperpigmentation. It's going to help lighten and brighten the skin. So this is going to help uh, reduce the appearance of dark spots. It's going to give skin clarity. It's going to even out the skin tone. Um, this is going to give you that more youthful looking appearance. I love this product as well. I put this in everybody's pretty much. Absolutely. And then we also have firming complex, which promotes skin firmness and helps maintain Obtain elasticity to reduce the appearance of fine lines and wrinkles. It uses glycerin and pea extract along with allergy extract, which work together to condition skin for a softer, smoother appearance. So yes, we also have anti-aging benefits for our powder as well. Right. So your client needs that anti-aging liquid foundation and they need that anti-aging powder foundation as well. So you need them both, right? It's going to work on different things on the skin. Um, and just like our other system, we do have three different bases in this particular one, light, medium, and dark that we can alter to make so many different formulas. So don't be confused because we only have three light, medium, and dark that we can't customize it to match your skin tone um, because we definitely can. And our powder foundation also always sell this in addition to your liquid. Um, it starts at an SPF of 17. Okay. So the SPF amount in here is really high as well. So adding that liquid SPF, adding your powder SPF, that liquid anti-aging, the powder anti-aging. If you do not notice, I'm telling y'all a theme here. You need that liquid and that powder together. Okay. <laughs> I love it. So yes, we only have three bases, but we have so many different toners, just like we do in the liquid to help us either uh, adjust the depth of the base shade or to help add undertone as well as neutralize unwanted tones. So we've got additives like Tiger's Eye, Agate, Alabaster, Onyx. Um, we've got Amber, Jade, Lapis, Amethyst, Rose Quartz, Sunstone, Tourmaline. That's that bright pink that Martha was uh, pointing out. But again, these are all just natural minerals from the earth. So they are very, very healing to the skin. Right. And so we do have a lot of support material, right? We don't want to, well, as a beauty professional, I don't want to be able to have access to a system like this and not know what to do with it. Um, so we have a manual that helps guide you and direct you on how to utilize a system to its best way. Um, we also have a custom blend recipe book. I love this recipe book because these recipes are not only by the company itself, but a lot of us who are in the field who love mixing, um, we create all kinds of different things and we submit it to the company and they put it in the recipe book so that we all have access to it. Because not only can you make liquid foundation and um, powders, but we can also make blushes and 
lipsticks and eyeshadows and eyeliners and the, the whole gamut you can really custom create. So I love that recipe book for that. And then we have surveys. Like we really need to sit down and have a consultation with the client to figure out their wants and needs for that particular uh, person and also formulation. Right? You know, you want to be able to recreate it after you make it once. You don't want just to throw stuff in a jar and just go, oh, okay, good luck next time you come around. We want to be able to recreate it. So we have that custom lens survey that tells you exactly how to put the system together, what things uh, like so client comes back to you and says, Hey, I need to replenish. You don't have to go through the whole consultation again. You can just say, okay, I have your formula. I'm going to mix it up. Is there anything that you want me to alter? And we can put this together for you. So we have a lot of support material in addition to our training. So I think that's awesome. Yeah. And I think that's really valuable because you're not in it alone. Right. And you have all the tools necessary. In fact, a lot of times when I first educate people on the system, they're like, I can't believe like how you just have it step by step and make it like easy for me to like learn. So like our goal is you should be able to just run with it right away and it shouldn't be too difficult. But if you have questions, then we're here for you. We also right. have different events put together for you. So one of the things that I love doing is our mix and mingle event where people just gather around a table and we literally help guide them into making their own. So it's like mix and mingle events and they're all creating their own formulas and just having a blast. So again, you don't have to recreate the wheel. We already have outlines. We have all sorts of different materials that go with these events ready where you can just plug and play and start making it happen. And they're super fun. I'm just going to tell you, this is a short little story. I want to tell you, um, not too long ago, maybe it was right before COVID hit. Um, we, uh, did a whole in-person event, um, and it was super fun. It was for a birthday party. And we did the beauty blend event where we had everybody sitting around the round table is about 15 people. And it was, um, the client birthday. Her name was Natalie. And uh, everybody bought their liquid, everybody bought their powder. And at the very end, it was like a two hour party. At the very end, I was packing up and one of the girls was like, hey, can you make a blush? And I was like, in my mind, I was like, I'm tired. I don't want to make a blush. But I was like, yeah, I can make a blush. It'll take two seconds, you know, whatever. And I asked her like what kind of blush that she wanted. And then I said, well, you get to name it. What do you want to name it? And she's like, I want to name it Natalie's birthday blush. And I was like, oh, okay, cool. And um, one of the girls was like, well, what are you making? I was like, Natalie's birthday blush. Well, then all 15 girls ended up buying Natalie's birthday blush because they wanted to have a blush that was named after Natalie's birthday that was made at her birthday party. Um, so it was a super fun event um, that we had in this little area here in Austin. And till this day, so many people call and be like, we need Natalie's birthday blush. And I'm like, oh, okay, cool. <laughs> so just a cute little story I wanted to share with y'all. I love that. I love that. Now, I, a lot of people ask, well, what's the profitability? Like, what can I make? Like, how much does it cost to make a custom blend? Well, we broke it down and literally it can cost as little as $15.75 all the way up to $17.50 to make a custom liquid. Of course, it depends what additives you're putting in. Um, this is also buying each additive at full price. So it can actually be even cut in half of that. And we'll share a little bit about that later. And this is also um, just a breakdown of what is going to go in the powder and how much it costs for the jar, for the toners, for the finish, if you're adding the skincare in it, if you're adding the anti-aging. And so the highest total is about $12.75. And like Lee said, these are based on numbers if you were buying the products individually at full cost um, so that you can actually cut the cost down a little bit more. So I think this is really awesome. Absolutely. And then you guys, like you can actually determine what you retail your blends for. Okay. So it really is going to depend on where you live, what your clientele is and what you're looking at. So we actually have two different scenarios. We have a very low end. Um, so if you would retail, a liquid custom blend for $45, we're just going to say it costs about $15 to make. It's going to be a $30 profit on that one bottle. Um, same with powder. Very low end would be $40. You can retail it for. It would cost about $15 to make. And 
that would leave you with about $25 retail profit. Now, if you decided that you wanted to sell the liquid for more like $65 a bottle, which honestly, I don't think is really that, that high um, because it is a custom blend product, custom made for them, it, the highest quality ingredients, minerals. But if we would retail them for $65 a bottle, um, it's going to give you a profit about $50 per bottle right in your pocket. Now, honestly, it might take you a little bit more time to make the first formula, but once you have that formula, it literally takes five minutes to remix that. So could literally be making $50 in five minutes. Who doesn't like that? Right. Right. And just so y'all know, uh, it's comparable to, um, foundation, high end foundations that you get on the market price wise. When you break the ingredients and how it's customized, I don't even think $65 is enough, but uh, it is a good starting point for sure. Um, yeah, I haven't charged 45 in a long time. Just letting y'all know folks out there. Um, and there are going to be people who, you know, charge more because of the area that they're in. So you could, we yeah, really and you can totally, you have, you know, you can dictate what what you charge because it is your, you know, your thing. However, yeah, you just can't go below that 45. (laughs) Don't go below that 45. (laughs) For the next few slides, we're going to use this scenario over here to show you what the low end can be. And then you can just increase that if you'd like, but we want to just show you low end so that, you know, you can kind of see what it would be in your, in your mind. So if you actually started, you know, and you're like, I'm going to try to do 30 blends in 30 days with my client, with my existing clientele, with new clientele, whatever that looks like for you, we know that every custom blend on the low end is going to average about $25 in retail profit. So at the end of one month, just achieving 30 faces in 30 days, that's going to be about $750 in retail profit on just custom blend. But here's the thing. If we add on some additional sales, we can actually increase that. And I'll let you just touch on a couple of, you know, these products, Martha. Right. Um, So whenever you come across people who are looking for a new foundation or powder, it is natural that you uncover or discover that they have other needs, whether it's internal, whether it's to make the foundation last longer, whether they don't have the correct tools, whether they, you know, just need a new updated um, thing in their cosmetic bag. So it's easily to add additional products. For example, our Tonics Beauty Blend. This is going to help with the skin's elasticity. It's going to help with hair, skin, and nails. It's going to help with collagen production. And so you can add this in addition to that foundation and powder. So this is going to be an internal product that you can add um, that will help with the skin of the client. Complexion Perfection Primer. We question all the time. There is primer in the foundation. Do I still need to use a primer? The answer is yes, because the primer in the foundation does something totally different than the primer that you would use in addition. So just like a car, you're not just going to start painting the car up. You need to prime the car first. You need to prime the walls first to make sure that paint adheres. So we need that makeup to adhere the best way using that primer. So it'll stay a lot longer. And then brushes, you know, (laughs) people always ask us, how do you apply foundation? You know, the the things that people use, you know, we have a great brush set that we can add in addition to Um, mascara. You know, there's some people where you're like, who, what can you not live without? And they're like, you could put me on a deserted island, but I can't live without my mascara. So we can add um, our Fiber Lush mascara to it. And then setting spray. Everybody always talks about their foundation not staying. Well, there's probably things that you are not doing prior to putting that foundation on or after you put that foundation on that's going to help with the longevity of the foundation. So a setting spray is going to be very important. So you can easily take that $65 foundation and add another $200, $300 on top of the price of the foundation because they do have other needs. So this is going to give you an additional profit about $64. So I think that's pretty awesome. Yeah, I do. And I think that this is kind of like the bare bones again. Like usually my clients end up purchasing a lot more because they're like, hey, what do you got for eyeshadow palettes? And what do you have for this and that? 
But again, we're kind of giving you conservative numbers just so that, you know, you can, you can see what is possible with it. So we already know that if we have 30 clients purchasing the blends and then adding in those complementary products, that is going to be an additional $1,920 in just those additional products to the same clients that are buying the blends, right? So if we add that in with our custom blend profit, that's $2,670 in the first 30 days of starting to custom blend and recommending other products. So does 2,670 sound good to everyone? Now, if you're charging more for your blends, like most people are, that number is just going to increase. So maybe you're charging twice as much. Like I know I see a lot of you are charging like 60, 65. That's just going to even be more retail profit. Now, if you went 90 days doing that, you guys, that's $8,010 in retail profit in your pocket. I mean, that's awesome. And again, that's just bare minimum. So what if we were even like half right, you know, right? or what if you were charging more like most people are, um, that's going to be a lot higher than that. So I don't know about you, but I like those numbers. Well, yes. Cause and when you break down these numbers, you know, and you're like, Hey, I need an extra $300 a month. Okay. You need an extra $300 a month. If you're charging say $60, um, for the foundation, well, how many foundations do you actually need to sell to make that extra $300? If you break down the numbers, I'm not that great at math. It's not that many. So if you have a calculator, let me know how many that would be. <laughs> What is it about eight? <laughs> I think it's about eight foundations. Eight times six is what? 30? I don't know. Who knows? Y'all math know. math. I'm math. I'm math terrible. It might be 15. Um, but my point is, is that you can break the numbers down to really create that income that you're looking for that extra 300, 600, 900, or, you know, 8,010 in 90 days. It's definitely yeah. possible. Uh, Cause I guarantee, you know, at least 30 people who don't like their foundation. Well, it's and seven. honestly, that could even be just like 15 people that want a liquid and powder too. So, you know what I mean? Right. Like, so if you have 30 clients purchasing both a liquid and powder, then again, those numbers are just going to even be even higher than that. So it's absolutely crazy. It's mind blowing. And then what tends to happen, just so you guys know, is once you start blending, everybody wants to tell their friends. So they're like, oh my gosh, like, you know, that you keep getting referrals from people because nobody else is doing this in your area, most likely. And you know what, then that's when you're like, maybe you should just have an event. You can invite all your friends over. And then guess what? If you've got eight people there, that's 16 more blends because each one's going to probably get a liquid and powder, which is likely. So it just kind of keeps like, once you get that snowball kind of rolling, it just kind of keeps uh, going like that. And then it becomes really, really fun. So that event that I told you we had with uh, Natalie's birthday party, right? Um, so they all came, they all bought a liquid and a powder. So it was $115 a person. Um, then they all bought Natalie's birthday blush. So 15 times 25. Okay. So whoever's mathing in the, in the, in the thing, cause they mathed for me, it was seven. If you want an extra $300. <laughs> Um, and then each one of them bought like an extra $50, right? So um, it was an awesome party. We did almost $2,000 and that was in two hours, you know, mind you, there was two um, custom blend specialists and then we had an assistant with us, but it was almost two grand in two hours time. So again, think of the number that you want and you can really break it down with what, how many you need to sell to achieve that. So I think it's absolutely. Really Iris came through five times 60 is 300. And Marisa says, I always say, don't, I don't do math. I do faces. It's so true. Right. <laughs> yes. Like I faces. only math whenever I'm, I'm, I'm uh, now collect when I'm it's time to collect. That's the only time I'm math. And then I have a, a calculator to do it. <laughs> yep. I've got my phone. <laughs> <laughs> right. <laughs> so building um, your business, right? Personal branding, customizing and marketing your materials. We have all of these things that mm -hmm. you really bring this to life for your business um, or for yourself or, or, or whatever it is, right? Um, I love that our company allows us to really personalize 
our custom um, products. So we can bottle them, we can brand them, and we'll, we can really put our business in the forefront. They're really just a company that allows us to use their products within our business. And that's what I really love. They don't want to be the face of our business. They want us to be the face of our business, but they want us to utilize our systems to be able to create more um, excitement and services and things that you just can't get anywhere. Absolutely. And I know we talked a lot about foundation, you guys, and Martha mentioned blush. The possibilities are endless. You can make uh, lip creams, brow pomades, um, these are glow sprays, uh, glow oil. Uh, I mean, like, bronzers, cream, uh, powder bronzers. It, it like, honestly, you guys like in that recipe book that Martha mentioned, we've got so many recipes just to really get you started, get you mixing. And then it's like, you can just create all sorts of different things. Um, and then let us know what you create so that we can all recreate it too. Right. And I've, I've had people within our team who've had extreme successes with some of these other products. Um, there's a girl at Dan Mark who um, creates this glow spray and she tints them with our different minerals. Um, her name is Stormy and she's done extremely well at a lot of vendor shows. Those tend to fly off the mark, uh, fly off the, the shelf for her. Um, I also have a um, business partner who is a, um, an influencer, a TikTok influencer. She's a impersonator and people are always asking her what color lipstick that she has or what color eyeshadow that she has. So she started custom creating lipsticks and bottling and branding them for herself. And she does little launches. Um, so she'll say, Hey, I only have X amount. I'm launching these. This is an exclusive um, color for this particular time. And we batch create them. And uh, she's been able to significant um, additional income to what she already does by utilizing her platform. Um, even if she has over, I think, 350,000 followers, even if she were to even capture 10% of that, the ability to um, make a little bit of money is significant with something that is branded specifically for her and customized to her clients' wants and needs. So, you know, think outside of the box from the foundation and the powders. You can do the lipsticks and the eye uh, shadows and the and the body glow sprays and all of these things. So, utilize the system to its fullest to really maximize that color and customization for your client. One of the things that me and Lee have done quite a bit is have you ever had someone say, Hey, I love this eyeshadow, but it's been discontinued. Mm -hmm. Can you create it for us? So here, one time Lee was here in Austin with me and we were customizing this found eyeshadow color that the client brought to us. And so we're like little mad scientists, like trying to figure out how to customize it and get the shimmer and all of the things that are needed into it. So really think outside of the box because these two systems, the liquid and the powder, you can use them together to really create so many different things. Absolutely. And those that decide to move forward and partner with us and learn how to custom blend, they actually get their own motivescosmetics.com website on that website, you will actually be given a survey so you can share a digital survey to those that are interested in getting a blend with you. And they can go ahead and answer all the necessary questions um, so that you have the information to you know, further service them with a custom blend. So we have both liquid and powder surveys on your motive site once you get certified. And then you will actually get an email that lets you know that they did complete it so that you can follow up with them, schedule that virtual consultation or one-on-one -on -one consultation with them. And so this is the entire system right here. We do have it available to you for you to order. Um, and it comes with not only the liquid system, the powder system, all the tools that you need to custom create to mix everything in. It comes with beakers, it comes with bottles, it comes with jars, it comes with the glass jars. It comes with absolutely everything that you need to be able to custom create a foundation, a powder, an eyeshadow, and a lipstick for your client. Absolutely. And you get 20 of each container. So I believe that comes to 100 containers that you can already get started filling. And once you fill all of those containers, 
Um, again, conservative numbers at the bare minimum, that's going to be at least $3,000. Now, if you're curious on what the kit costs, definitely reach out to the person that invited you. Um, right now, that kit is 50% off buying all of those separate. So you're saving 50% right off the bat and then able to generate minimum of $3,000 um, by filling all those containers you're going to get in your kit. So that's really the goal. Plus, you are going to have an established client book of 100 formulas that you can mix up again and again. And those refill orders will continue to come uh, as you're even servicing new clients, which is really great. So I know a lot of you are like, okay, what are my next steps? I don't know how, you know, where you're, where you're at. If you've taken the courses before, if you've ever tried a custom blend, we have all different people on here. Um, but you know, maybe your next step is trying some product, maybe having a custom blend done for you. I know we have some guests on here tonight that have actually gone that route already and had their custom blend and they're really interested. Um, trying it is awesome. Or you could try any of our other products as well. You can attend a training. We have some trainings coming up that we will uh, give you access to. Our, our trainings are open to anybody that wants to learn. So even if you just want to learn a little bit more about the system before you decide to get going, um, you're more than welcome to attend our, our trainings, get certified. And then once you get the kit, you're all ready to go. Or this is my favorite one too, is evaluate our marketing plan. Our company actually has different ways that you can actually partner with our company. Um, so we can kind of customize whatever works for you and your goals and your wants and, you know, see if what we have is a good fit for you. Our brand is really built solely on the word of mouth and we pride ourselves on customizing the journey for each individual. And so let the person that invited you know how you want to move forward and, you know, get your questions answered from them. Absolutely, for sure. Um, so as promised, we do have some classes coming up. I'm actually doing a hybrid certification at the end of this month on April 30th. Hybrid means that you can attend online um, or you can attend in person. I will be at a salon, so we'll have live uh, guests there taking their students taking the course. But you're more than welcome to tune in. And did you guys like see how much our trainings are? They're like $40 and $20. I mean, they're like so reasonably priced. So we keep them that way so that people will attend. We also have a custom blend certification. This is going to be a virtual course coming up on Sunday, May 7th um, with Cornelia, who is rocking it on TikTok, blending her way on TikTok. So she's absolutely doing a wonderful job. And so she's going to be having a virtual, um, course coming up. So if you guys are interested in these courses, you can scan this QR code or go to this link. And we also have Cornelia's link here. And then and I have yet to submit mine, but I should be submitting mine tomorrow because I just got, uh, of the green light that we're a go, but I will be actually in Wichita, Kansas um, on May 5th. And we will have a custom blend class that night. And then the next day we will have a skincare class. So that will be an in-person, most likely hybrid um, on May 5th in Wichita, Kansas. So if you are in the area, come out and see me because I would love to see your face in person. Uh, so I'll have those details uh, pretty soon by the end of the week for sure. Awesome. And then I will be teaching with you. We're doing a hybrid certification in June. Um, you can join us in New Hope, Pennsylvania, or you can join us online. And that's June 10th uh, from 10 a.m. to 5 p.m. So these are the trains we have um, upcoming in the next few months. Of course, we are continually offering trainers from our entire training team. Uh, so there'll be more to come as well. So just reach out to the person that invited you if you have any questions. Otherwise, you can always reach out to motives at shop.com as well if you have any questions. But I really appreciate you all being with us tonight. And thank you, Martha, for joining me. It was fun hanging out with you again tonight. Always. Thank you for always inviting me and letting me hop on with you because I also 
always have a great time. And I love sharing um, our custom blend system with everyone because it's really something that's very exclusive. You can add it very simply to your um, business and you can really do a lot of things to customize and have that exclusivity for your clients. So I think it's pretty amazing. So thank you again. Awesome. Have a good evening, everybody. Bye. Bye.